natin mag-gaming dito sa iPhone 14 Pro Max. But before that, let me try this one on. Itong Razer na foam cooler chroma na nakuha natin no, for iPhone. So there's two kinds of this one. So there's one for Android and another one for iPhone. So ang advantage nito na meron nila for iPhone is ano siya na magsi. So all you need to do is just clip it at the back of your phone and you're ready to game. Unlike sa mga Android, you need to clip it kasi wala sila magsi. Now this is how it looks like. Really looks cool. Okay, so all you need to do is just peel this one off. Okay. Ayan. Then, idirikit nyo na sa likod ng iyong phone. So, this one is basically USB Type-C powered. And this one comes with the A to C cable from Razer. And it also comes along with a user guide. So, try natin. No? So, once nakilapit na natin ng power, you can switch it on here. So, this is how it looks like. Sa likod, ang ganda niya, no? So, there's RGB lights here. And wind is blowing here. So, dito sa direction na ito. Dito ang intake niya. Dito ang exhaust niya. And the chroma really looks nice. Talagang ganda ng gawa ni Razer, no? And yung likod niya is beginning to freeze. Ang lamig na dito, pag hinawakan mo. Yan. Okay? So, yan. Kita natin, ano? Kung frost na siya. So, mabilis na siya kabit dito sa likod ng iPhone, no? Yan. Dito mo na ilalagay, no? So, halos di mo na siya matatanggal. Yan. No? Ganda dito sa, ano, no? sa iPhone, MagSafe. Sobrang kapit na ganang magnet, no? So, ganang, ganang kaganda. Which, on the opposing side, sa Android, I wish na pwede niyang gumana din sa Android, no? This one is also wireless charging capable. Si Samsung Galaxy S3 Ultra. Well, kumakapit naman siya. Pero, eventually, malalaglag din siya. Pag, ano, no? Pag tagkatagalan, no? So, hindi siya ganang kakapit. And you have another option na mabibili, no? From uh, Razer, which is for Android. So, yeah. This one is also ma only made for iPhone. So, let's just simply try it out. Ganito lang siya, no? So, let's, let's... So, let's also play a quick game ng Tower Fantasy. So, while loading, this is how it looks like. This is sa likod niya, no? It looks really cool. Itong Razer Chroma. And I like it. It really cools down your phone by around mga 5 degrees Celsius, no? So, giving your phone really yung, ano, no? If you're playing for long hours, it is iPhone 14 Pro Max or any iPhone na may wireless charging. This one is a very perfect device companion to go together with your gaming needs, no? Para todo lamig ang yung phone while you're playing the game for more than 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 hours. Kung sino malama kung saan pwede mo bilin, link on the description. And what's, and what's nice dito sa Razer Phone Cooler Chroma, pwede rin siya mag-act as a stand. Tira na guys, oh. nakataya na ang aking phone. So, habang pinapalamig mo, pwede ka manood. Or just, well, <laughs> make it a phone stand. Medyo mahal na phone stand. So, kita natin ang gameplay dito sa iPhone 14 Pro Max. It seems to me it's a little bit more smoother as compared kay Samsung, no? And yung gameplay was really smooth, naka, even naka highest graphical settings. And I don't expect the same things against Genshin Impact, no? Na ang gaming niya would also be very smooth. So guys, kung gusto niyo makita more gaming performance, uh, you can also check my full review nito iPhone 14 Pro Max. Link up there. So guys, after playing nito ng game nito, no? So iPhone 14 Pro Max. Medyo may pagkamainit dito sa likod when you're playing long games na mga Genshin Impact and Tower Fantasy. But after replacing itong Razer Cooler na Chroma, itong likod niya, no, was definitely a lot cooler. So, based on what I've tested, it has dropped around mga 5 degrees Celsius, which is pretty not bad. If you want to use itong Razer Chroma na may case sa likod, you should buy yung mga MagSafe na case, no? So, para magamit mo itong cooler na nakamagnet pa rin with yung case mo. But of course, best effect is definitely pag nakakabit siya dito sa likod ng iyong phone.